Well, boomer, sooner, everybody. My name's Harry James. The Oklahoma Sooners, women's basketball team, always, 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 always a competitional team, a competitive team, and they always get to the big tournament. But a couple of road games are in their blocks this week. In Stilly against the Aggie Girls of Oklahoma State, and a game against the Red Raider, Red Raiding Wreck of Texas Tech. We'll preview those two games and preview the University of OKLAHOMA coming up next. Boomer Sooner 1982, don't go away. <laughs> Welcome back to the show, everybody. My name's Harry James. The Bedlam game is never easy, no matter what sport you're in. Football, basketball, even women's basketball is getting a little better at it. it with Jim Littell now in charge of the Aggies of Oklahoma State. An Oklahoma State team that, as of last year, was two games over 500 at 17 and 15. And they were 6-12 and 12 in Big 12 play. Their head coach is the aforementioned Jim Littell, who is a 1977 grad from Southwestern College. Uh, they they did, made it to the NCAA tournament last year. They lost to Abilene Christian, 66-56, to uh, in the first round of the women's NCAA tournament. And uh, Coach Littell is in his seventh year in Aggieland, in Stillwater. Helping him get back to the big dance. A couple of players averaging double figures coming back, including number 54, Kaylee Jensen, and number 3, Mandy Coleman. We'll start with 54, Kaylee Jensen, averaging 18.7 points per ballgame last year for the Aggies, while getting 10.5 rebounds and 1.3 assists per ballgame for the Cowgirls. Well, they also have number three, Mandy Coleman, who averages 11.9 points per game, 7.1 rebounds per, per ball game, and 1.6 assists per ball game last year for the, for the Cowgirls of Oklahoma State. The Aggies aren't the only away game the Sooners have, though, in the, in the next couple of days. They, all, they will also trouble the Lubbock and face Texas Tech. A Texas Tech game... Team that was, let's see, 14 for 17 last year, 5 and 13 in conference play. Their head coach is Candy Whitaker, who's a 2002 grad from the Raiders of Texas Tech. They lost in the uh, quarterfinal round of the Big 12 championships up the road at the peak. They lost that one 95 to 63 to eventual champion Baylor. And uh, regular season champion Baylor, that is. And Coach Witts Whitaker is in her fifth year for the double T's of Texas Tech. And the Mast Raiders. Helping them get turn things back around pretty quickly. Number four, Reese Caldwell. And number 12, Jada Terry. Well, number four, Reese Caldwell averages 14.5 points per ball game, 2.8 rebounds, and 4.5 assists per ball game for the Raiders. Well, they also have number 12, Tata Jerry, Jada Terry, who averages 9.4 points per ball game, 6.2 rebounds, and 0.4 assists per ball game for the Raiders of Texas Tech. And now our homegrown Sooner Boomers. The Oklahoma Sooners, 12-9 last year, 13 for 5 and 5 
in Big 12 league play. They lost to Washington 102-82 to in the second round of the NCAA tournament, women's version. Their head coach is Sherry Cole, the 1980 grad from Oklahoma Christian University. And this is Sherry's 22nd year wearing the crimson and cream on the sidelines. Helping Coach Sherry Cole keep that entitlement of getting back to the tourney every year for Sherry Cole. Two players, number the averaging double figures last year. Number 23, Maddie Manning, and numeral zero, Bees Pierre Louis. We'll start with 23, Maddie Manning, who averaged last year 12.6 points per ballgame for the Sooners, while averaging 5.4 rebounds and 2.1 assists per ballgame for Oklahoma. While they also have Vise Pierre Louis, number zero, who averages 11.9 points per ball game, 7.9 rebound, 11.9 points per ball game, 7.9 rebounds per ball game, and 0.8 assists per ball game for the Sooners of Oklahoma. All right, guys, it's been fun. It's been great. Uh, sorry I was off last week, guys. I had a lot to do out in Cali. Didn't have a lot of chance to do some videos. But uh, we'll go back and we'll review the last two weeks of women's hoops in the next video. Don't miss that one. If you do, it's okay. You can just find it on the YouTube. Uh, Boomers in this one, by the way, and any of my other ones, Boomer Sooner 1982. Uh, you can also find it on my Facebook account, Harry James Taylor, or on my Twitter, at Hype Man Harry. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. And... Uh, Boomer sooner, everybody. Take care. I'm out of here. See ya.